Okay guys, so this product, this Kate Somerville Exfoliate Glow Moisturizer, I actually had to look up some other videos and photos of it online because I, when I opened it, I was like, what in the world? What is that color? Is it like moldy? Has it gone bad? Why does it look like that? That's really weird. Like this color just is not what I was expecting at all. Um, usually when you open up a product, it, you'll see that it's like white or sort of like clear. Um, but this has sort of like a greenish, sort of an odd kind of like greenish tint to it. Um, but when I did look up pictures of it and um, other reviews of it, I did see that other people have this same color. <laughs> so, um, and I haven't had any other indication that there's anything wrong with it. It smells fine. It looks fine. It works great. So um, I think that this is normal. So don't be alarmed if you see this color in here. Um, and I did get this in BoxyCharm. So it was a great, great uh, deal. So I will need to save that. Um, I don't know if I would necessarily pay full price for this because I think it's actually pretty expensive. Um, if you can get it on sale, I would absolutely recommend it because um, I think it has done a really, really good job if you put it on overnight of like smoothing my skin, like kind of like it actually does really exfoliate it. This is a exfoliate glow. Um, it does have AHAs in it and it really does what it claims to do. I don't know why there's like a winky face there. That's kind of funny. So there's like the winky face and the weird color. So it's a little, a little bit strange. It does kind of just take off that very top layer of just kind of kind of skin that's kind of on its way out. So you're left with a very smooth, like baby soft complexion in the morning. And it's really, really nice. And of course you are, it does say sunburn alert. You are supposed to use sun, a lot of sunscreen when you use products like these, anything that says that it's going to do a lot of exfoliating, it is going to make your skin more sensitive to the sun. So be careful about that. And, um, yeah, this has been a really good product and I have generally really liked the Kate Somerville products that I've tried so far. Um, especially their goat milk cleanser and this product I have absolutely been enjoying a lot. And I've used this quite a while, quite uh, a number of times. And as you can see, I still have a ton of product left. So that's really, really nice. And as for the scent, you know, it vaguely reminds me of like the scent of a, of a clay mask. It's like slightly the scent of a clay mask, but then like slightly citrusy, I want to say, but it does definitely have a faint scent to it. And yeah, um, let me see the, show you the consistency. It's pretty thick. Um, I really like with my face products when it's pretty thick because when it's something that's really thin and watery. It's kind of like you're frantically trying to like rub it in before it like drips off your face. So I do like that a lot of these products I've been trying have been very thick and you can, you have plenty of time to just massage it into your face. So yeah, that's really, really nice. Let me know if you guys have been trying any exfoliating products and yeah, this has been a good one and 1.7 fluid ounces. And that's it. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.